What do you think it is, Josh? Looks like a racer. Is that a racer? Dude, I've never caught one. He's crapping all over me. Dang, that's the first time, my first racer. Dude, that's cool. Look how beautiful he is. Does he have a mean bite? Dude, I think there was another one. I just saw him. I stepped down. Awesome. Good. Bit himself. Ooh, he bit himself, yeah. He's fast. Dang. That is cool, man. Dude, how awesome is this? <laughs> oh, that was my face. Dang, I didn't get it. You it didn't was, get it, bro? It was zoomed out. It was zoomed out too, Dang. too much. Dude, he almost came close to my face, bro. Dude, he almost got my face. Dude, how awesome. Is this about like as big as they get? Uh, this yeah, is definitely that's, an adult. That's about that, uh, that's about how long I've seen them. I'm pretty sure it's a racer. Not a coach whip? No, I don't think it's coach whip. Coach whip got a little pattern to him. So it's a black racer. Super fast, right? That's what I'm pretty sure it is. Dude, there's yeah. no way I could have caught him. I, I chased after him. There was no way I could have caught him. I think there's a snake den. I think there are dens everywhere through here. It's just like snake city over here. He's zoning in on me. He stinks, I know that. He does stink. Look how long he is. Oh my goodness. He is as long as, look at this right here. Let it's me show you. first big snake. Why can't he we? He's not as you. Dude, he is as long. He's about a six, he's five foot at least. No, he's as long as me. <laughs> he's a five foot snake, man. Please, look at this guy. Please, can we keep him, Daddy? I don't know, baby. I don't think so. He's just way too long. He's a beautiful snake, though. Let's just look at him real quick. Yeah, he probably likes it because of the weather. And look at the, um, the weather. Oh, he's going to be a mean bite. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, he's super huge. <laughs> just really cool. I'm sure he wants to bite me. He's got a, he's got a triangle-shaped head, Wait, but he's oh. got the round pupils in his eyes. I want him to bite the phone. I just don't know. Bite the phone, bite the he phone. won't bite the phone. Why? This is not sensing the heat like it's a person or, or an animal. Oh. He can strike at me right now. He can reach with this long body. He can reach me. He got. He almost got my face earlier. Yeah, I, I heard you. <laughs> <laughs> Did you touch him? Yeah. Don't do that. <laughs> Why? Don't drop him. <laughs> <laughs> he doubled over. Five feet, at least five feet. Beautiful snake. I've never seen anything like it. I've never encountered one like this. Look at his face. Looks like a lizard's face, right? He's gonna get me bit, bro. No, you good. See his face? Might be regurgitating. Oh, that's awesome. Girls, you wanna hold him? He's watching me. That's okay. Ooh, yeah. I wanna hold him. Go back. slow underneath, just like this. And just let him feel like he's crawling away. Just like that. Slow movements. What do you think, Ori? Right now, Daddy, I don't want to fight me. He's coming after me. I've never ran into this snake before. We're here in central Texas, a little bit east by Palestine. And uh, beautiful snake, super fast. This guy was, as soon as I saw him, he darted out of there. Uh, very aggressive snake, of course. Like most of the snakes I handle, they're aggressive. But really fast, beautiful, definitely non-venomous. You want to hold him now that he's calm, girls? Ooh. Easy, slow, don't let him look at you. Okay, now you can go ahead and just kind of slowly. Yeah, don't go any closer to his face, I don't think. Let me go ahead and release him. Let's see how fast he is. 
There he goes. Well, he's not being super fast right now, but when he wants to, look how long he is, man. So crazy, look at this. So long. Is he climbing? Oh, he's climbing. He's climbing his tree. Look at that, look at him climb. Get away. Instead of hauling all the trash out of here, we're just gonna burn some of these, some of this trash right where it lays. Perfect day for it, everything's green, no burn bans. This is all part of deer lease management and land management. So we'll take and we'll just clean up anything that's trashy and just start burning what. Hot. Burning stands, old stands. That's a brown recluse. Just kidding. It's all part of it. It's work, but it's it's fun for us. You know, part of deer season and part of managing land whether it's yours or a deer lease or you know whatever in texas we have deer leases is what is what i call it most people own the land they don't want to give up ownership but they want people to come on and manage the herd manage the land keep it clean maintain it as long as we better it then the landowner owner doesn't mind and so kids get to enjoy it out here it's all part of the texas jungle experience and of course managing any old stands, this place hasn't been managed in a while, so you gotta make it better, you gotta clean it up, you wanna keep it natural, you know? We could even burn some underbrush eventually just to kinda, you know, do a control burn. But lots of squirrels, lots of animals, lots of oak trees around here, pecans. It's just a really nice spot, I think Josh is gonna like it this year, so we're gonna try to better it and uh, give him a, a fun experience. Perfect day for this. It's been raining, it's cool, it's not windy. And, uh, and it, there's a slight chance of rain all around us and it's misting a little bit, so perfect day to do this. Sorry. Eggs. That's crazy how they just lay we saw a turkey buzzard fly out of here. It's crazy to me how they, huge eggs. You're not seeing them supposed to touch them or they're protected. Crazy. That's a turkey vulture, turkey buzzard. Ow, ow, ow. Oh, it looks like, looks like a tree is catching fire a little bit, but it's just the branches above it. It's too green now. It shouldn't, it shouldn't continue to catch on fire. Now, if it stayed hot like this for a while, it, that whole tree can go up in flames. Well, that's what we have left of the first first fire. That burned up pretty nicely, I'd say. There you go. That's what's left. So I'm gonna push some of this in into the fire just so it all burns while it's hot Whoa. a 
Well, it's all on fire. It needs to burn. There we go. It's starting to look better over here. Well, that's all we got for you for now. Kids are exhausted. We got some wildflowers for mama. And we're just going to go take showers, have some mac and cheese and chicken nuggets, and uh, watch a short movie. And then we're probably going to go straight to bed. There's one right there. She said none of that stuff sounds good, so she's really exhausted. And then Orel says mac and cheese and chicken nuggets sounds good. Mm -hmm.